Udo Ranch, a map that's just released today, being Thursday on the Xbox One. It is a file size of 415 megabytes. This is the first release for it, available on all platforms. And the description says it has 26 fields, one farm, sheep, pigs, cows, chickens, BGA, large railway and animated objects. I thought we'd maybe take a quick fly around the map and have a look at it. Um, reason being that I was thinking of maybe putting something out in between episodes on Drummar just to fill the gap if you're waiting. And maybe looking at this as a possible small series in between there. Uh, maybe not going to do it the same way as everybody else does it. Um, I'm not going to do it like Drum Mart where you're going to see every minute of the gameplay. I'm going to use this as a single player map for myself and maybe bring you in a few times a week just to see how we're getting on and what we're doing and update you and things and we'll catch some of the more interesting stuff going on rather than waiting around and seeding and crops growing etc. Um, so yeah, let's get into this. Something on my shoe 2 has released this map. It's the same mod author as the Mustang Valley Ranch and the American Outback. So it should be a half decent map. Um, first of all, let's take um, a look at the starting equipment. We'll just go into the garage. Okay, we're going to start off with a Case 1455XL. 1660 axial flow with a 14 foot header, a farm tech trailer, oh, Kun 3 meter ply, a Salford 2 meter ply, the Grip Plains seed drill, the Amazon sprayer, and that's it. Ooh, we're starting off pretty low. We have the usual 25 grand starting capital and we also have a loan I believe which is probably going to be the usual 50 grand uh, where are we? loan yep there we are usual 50 grand of a loan to pay off um ah well we'll live with that let's take a quick look at the map then quite a nice size of a map say 26 fields the animals are all up in one area, which is going to keep it pretty easy up here and here, where you can see the cursor just moving. It should keep it pretty easy to keep on top of those. Me and farm, it's more or less the middle of the map. And uh, let's see, where's the chickens? They're over here, beside the couple of cell points, spinnery and. Bakery with a shop. Um, yeah, it looks pretty interesting. We have the sawmill over here in what looks to be in the middle of a lake, so it must be a water drop off, I would imagine. And we're only going to start with what looks like field 12. Yeah, it looks like field 12 is the only, only field we have to start with. Yeah, that is indeed. Well, let's just jump in the tractor and take a quick look around. And let's run around the farmyard first. Pretty big open yard. Water tower. Yeah. Some nice big storage sheds. Two of them too. I wonder what he means by animated objects on this map, but we'll see. Let's see what we've got over here. We have the... Oh, flickering textures. It's a machine repair and upgrade. Some storage shelves. Used for seed, etc. Again, there's your repair shop. A bit more storage there. A lot, a lot of storage. He normally has a lot of storage on his maps anyway. Nice big open drive-through hangar. 
the covers which have come straight out of Sosnovka or however you pronounce that or combine or tractor uh, oh now this is interesting place to get rid of it straight straw and hay that's new that is very new Looks to be some sort of heating plant. Well, it's new on console anyway. A couple more of the big hangers. Some of the equipment dotted in about it. Some more lean two stories there. I haven't seen any gold coins yet on this ma or gold nuggets yet. Railway line. I wonder if we get to use the railway in this. Let me just make sure I have the... Oh, first of all, get rid of that. Uh, skip the trains. Oh. Money in it. Here we go. Switch the trains is on, okay, so we'll have a look at that in a second. The silo system. Drop off right down the middle here. And a pick up here. Yeah. I would assume fertilizer and Seeds. I well, would we'll probably need to test that out. And just round to the house where we were. Again, I will have to confirm or not if there is a gold nuggets on this. Be nice to have them, especially with a, such a small starting setup that we have. And that looks to be it for the yard. Let's skip and see if we can get through trains. Oh, we do have trains. One at least. Parked in the middle of nowhere. Radio, let's get the tractor and let's have a wee look about. Where to first? Where do I think? Um, I maybe think up the corner affiliate and go from there. That way we can get a wee look at what fields, etc, etc. We're not on drummer, so we do drive on the wrong side of the road here. Canal system. Interesting. Right. Where are we going? Oh, keep out of the cars. We're heading right. We'll just head to the end of this and we'll turn right and head to the top of the map. The diner. Nothing there to say anything about cell point. It looks like the train station from Goldcrest. Let's take a quick peek at that on the way past. I wonder if it works the same. Well, it does have the pipes. So we'll assume you can load your grain, etc. onto this. And you can load it in your truck. Again, some flickering textures there. Yep, looks like we can load the train from there. Excellent. Alright, where were we? Back up onto the main road here and we'll head to the corner of the map. Pretty flat map from what I can tell so far. Coming along. Oh. 
Apparently it's Gullcrest Arcade. That's interesting. The building is obviously just taken straight from Gullcrest. And this is your shop then, and it's Morgan's Massive Motors. It's taken away the trigger here. For the customization, and obviously your vehicles are all going to appear here. Let's keep going along the road. And we'll stop at anything interesting on the way by. <coughs> Bakery sale point. In ground, nothing covering it. Good. Something on my shoe too seems to have the like oh egg cell point has a like for covered cell points. Not too sure why. What's this? Spinnery. Sell the wool. Oh, and there's our chucks. Our chucks as I would say in Australia and some more of the covers from Susnovka. Oh, 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 oh. Did I just spot one? There it is, gold nugget. We have discovered a gold nugget, so one out of a hundred. So the gold nuggets are active on the map, class. Let's just keep going along and up to the top corner. There are some waterways in here. I wonder if we can actually find anywhere to get free water on this map. Another cell point here. Looks like it's a train cell point though. So we pick if there's any No. Nothing there to sell from the trains. Could be on the other side. Oh, we do. We have a train cell point here. Excellent day. <coughs> Should have maybe put some money in this and get a faster vehicle, but yeah, uh, we'll we'll survive. Ooh, it's the train lines that run up the edge. The yellow lines are the train lines. That's interesting. Field 12 is just down here. Let's have a quick peek at field 12. Take a shortcut on the train lines. And we can't get across with a fence. Ugh. Typical Thomas. Short cuts turn into long cuts. Can we get across? No. Looks like this fence is going to run forever. So far looking so good. One thing I do actually want to check here. Are these fields giants? They are. <coughs> Excellent. You can use hard workers in these fields. They've not been painted on. They've actually been given field definitions. Good, 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 good. Oh. We're only trying to have a look at field 12 here. Crashing left, right and centre. Guess we could have used the train to tour the map. Well, there you go, guys. There's a point for you if you ever want to take a shortcut, or I suggest a shortcut to anybody. Don't take it. Right, let's go up and have a peek at field 12. Oh, what's this in here? I think this is the BGA. It is indeed. So we've got one, two, three, four, five pits. Ten pits. Ooh. Looks like this could be a bit of a multiplayer map, which would probably be better. Big bit of stories there. Digest it. 
steward here. There is your entrance and exit. Ooh, got some flegel bins. Nice. Oh, an extendable ramp. Let's see. Open and close, that's it. <coughs> that's nice. Make it a bit easier to sell. I wonder if we can actually use tippers in this. Mm. Right, well, let's get back to looking at field 12. Being our only field. Oh, stop signs, nice. We'll go back up this way to field 12. Oh, flashing crossing signs. Why is the barrier down? Our train must be somewhere close to here. Ah, they're parked there, that's why they're down. And here is field at 12. Our only field. Looks like a nice size. It's been plied for us, which has been nice. But let's head on up the map into the corner. Let's have a peek and see where we're going. We'll check out the sawmill next, I think. Which is probably going to be there. There's no roads taken up that way, so we have to go back. This could be a long-winded approach to this. I think maybe when we get the tractor up here, we'll just hop around between the different points. Oh, what's this? Authorised vehicles only? Hmm. We'll not drive down, we'll run down there. Could be the exit. Storage. What have we got here? Question marks are always good. Selling point for wood. That's interesting. Aha, you must be able to get the train to drop off there. Take a run up and have a look quickly. Must be wood chips, I would assume. And another. Yeah. Wood chips. That is coming to Gold Crest too, actually. But it's nice to have another ramp in there. And. Let's go swimming. And apparently this is the sell point for wood as well. Interesting. There's nothing really here to say. No crane or anything. Looks like another train stop there. The pick. Don't we all just love to go for a, a nice dip? Breaststroke all the way. Ah, that could have been a mistake. There doesn't look to be anywhere to get out here. Uh-oh. Oh, no. There we are there. Well, the water does have the flowing texture to it, and that normally... Normally means that you can... Grab water from there. I believe that's just an extension of the bridge from Sosnovka as well. I may be wrong on that. And another, yep, another train drop off. That's where the lines mix. Excellent. Yeah. So where to next? We'll dump the tractor for the time being. And we'll just skip around to the places I think might be easier. See, so we'll probably discover more of them or, um, in the let's play.
maybe, hopefully. Alright, so visit the sheep. Let's see what the sheep are like. Pigs. Pretty normal looking sheep pasture. Oh, openable gates. No sound, no sound file to them though. Feeding. Okay. Let's take a run up and have a look and see what the... Obviously they're pigs because of the styes there. What's this? Oh, sheep drop off. <coughs> I just jumped the fence. Some more storage. Oh, second gold coin. Fuel tanks. Some more big storage areas. Grass bills, etc. Obviously that's for the poop from the pigs. Ah, did we come up? Is that the one we come up? I don't think so. Straw for the pigs. Or you to buy, drop the pigs off. So, ah, that's where you get your liquid poop. Again, feeding areas. Interesting. And then cows, water, feed. Straight from Glowcrest again, isn't it? Double gates. What's the grass texture over here? Maybe I'm wrong, but this looks like it's been given a field definition too. Obviously, oh, area for dropping your cows off. Feeding. Train line runs right past here. Interesting, you could probably do a lot of grass that way. Another silage pit and just more storage. And there's your solid manure and your slurry. Okay, okay. Usual. Oh, well, this is where your cows are going to appear. All right, let's have a look and see where's next on the map. So we've done that. Done the sheep. We'll take a look at. The real loader. We've been to that actually, haven't we? Oh no, we haven't. Interesting. Again, straight from Sosnovka. For loading up beets, etc. Why have you got a digest? Must be a sell point. Uh, sell point for manure and slurry. And a way bridge. Well, it was a way bridge. Some storage. Yeah. Interesting that they give us this device for loading up trains. More storage. Okay, let's have a look at what's next. Go on, keep going to the wrong menu. The green elevator, which again is visitable by trains. Do you have to use trains on this map to sell most things then? It's just a sail point. And no way to pick up from it. Okay. The only way to get to that is <laughs> drive the train down there. I'm, I don't even think you'd be able to dump in them from a lorry unless you had like a belly loader or something. Belly dump. Alright, next one.
notes we had here. Animal dealer. This straight from Goldcrest. Interesting. And we have a. Ooh, that looks unique. Hey, Marky boy, how's it going? I'm all good too, thanks. That actually does look very unique. It's a custom model. Ah, it's a covered sale point with all like those. What's next on the map? Okay. We've been to the green elevator. That's our farmyard. Been to the BGA. Square fields, big bud's gonna work well on this map. Another petrol station, what's that? John D strains. John D's greens even. That's Oh, camouflage. It's another covered cell point with the same building again. Another gold nugget. It's going to be hard to use the big tippers in these. Like the BSM trailers and stuff get caught in the roof in this. Interesting though. Let's have a look and see what else is on the map. Um, well, that looks a bit. Let's jump back into your tower here. There must be a one-way system in here. Let's have a look and see if we can get in actually. Ah, let's go let us in this way, I think. No. So all that area in there, you can't get into? I wouldn't think so. I wouldn't like to think you have to come in this way to it. Definitely the bridges from South Noska. You can't get in, does it let you out? No. Ah, you have to open the barrier yourself. Although there's no option to open it. There's no button to open it. There is no button to open this barrier. The doors to this place open. Oh, you can. So we've got a lot of storage down here as well. That's pretty cool. Let's just see if we can get out down here or not. Okay, it doesn't open that way. Again, no way to open the barrier. Hmm. I'm 
Not too sure about that. So it's making you go over the bridges to get in. Maybe you have to be in a log tour a log trip or something, I don't know. More storage here too, look. What's this? The light switch. Ah. So we can come work it down here at night time, that's cool. Doors are very slow. Hmm. I suppose it's gonna keep me going until the uh, Black Sheep Modern get their map out. Let's just go on across here and get out of this. I don't like the way it's making me go through those barriers though. I will let me go through those barriers. Again. Uh, oh, maybe the tractor was too close. No. Hmm. Authorized vehicles only. Maybe it's a glitch in the map. <coughs> Again. If it is, I don't like it. If you have to come in and out through train lines, it's, it's going to be a bit awkward and a bit stupid. Let's go quickly down to the bottom right hand corner of the map there and we'll end it. I just want to see what's down there by the lakes. Actually, should we once I finish this I'm going to go back up to the um, oh, back up to the uh, cows. I want to see if we can get water out there. Let's just take us. It's dangerous in some fields, is it? Yeah. Making the tractor suspension work hard, though, look. It's definitely a unique looking building. Tell you what, instead of driving down there, what we'll do is we'll quickly jump down to one of the closer fields. And there isn't any. Probably your closest there, look. I suppose we'll do what we're here, we'll check out. There is missions. The fields are pretty pricey. I just want to run down here and have a look then. I'm interested to see what this body of water is down here. I'm in the right way, yeah. We are. Children of the Sunflower. There's only trains that go down that way. Hmm. Strange. Well, we're getting there. So, just want to look and see if we can get water up the cows after this, and then we'll have a check and see what the price of the biggest field is. There's a building down here. Looks like a train warehouse. It's not on the map. Oh, 
Well, you'd be able to get a trailer in for water there, but it's pretty far away. A bit more storage in our gold nugget. Drop off. Ah, you can just pick up there, look. And it's not gonna let me up over that. Storage. Definitely plenty of storage on the map now. Trains are coming out. They are actually on a big bit of land. There's the bridge. I take it that's just a tunnel for the ends of the map, maybe. It is. Right guys, let's just take a quick look. I want to see check out the cows and then I'll call it quits for this. Let's go. And there's water here. There's no way out of the cows there anyway. Oh, it's pretty steep. A bit of forest up around here though. Too much exercise isn't good for you anyway. And again, I'll pop back to the cows. And we'll try it going from the road this time. Map. Um. I have been waiting on a map coming out. I know everyone's like a, a kid at Christmas waiting on the West Coast coming out but Bullet Bill. Um, possibly might do something similar in that. I don't know. But I think everyone and their granny's going to be wanting to play the West Coast when it comes out. So do you really want to see a series on it? Doesn't look like anywhere to get in there for water either. Yeah, but guys, let me know what you think of the map. If you'd like to see me, you know, I'm going to play this as a single player, but if you want to see me coming in now and again and filling in some time between drum art, showing you a few things on here, let me know down below. Um, again, thanks for joining in. Have a good one. Bye-bye.